In this video, I'm gonna show you how to connect your bank and credit card accounts to your Zoho Books account. Hey everyone, my name is Stephanie Smith and I'm a Zoho Finance Partner at AIO Bookkeeping. At AIO Bookkeeping, we help business owners do business better by getting their bookkeeping in order and reconnecting them with their business finances. Thanks for joining us on our YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Now let's dive in. The great part about using a cloud-based accounting software is that you can typically connect your bank and credit cards to your accounting software. This makes it really easy to have all of your transactions automatically imported into your accounting software and you can just make your categorizations from there. So we're going to set that up in Zoho Books. And the first thing you want to do is click the banking option. If you haven't done this before, you'll see this page here. You'll want to click this big red button that says connect bank slash credit card. Zoho Books can be connected with major banks and credit cards. And you'll see that automatic bank feed supported banks option at the top. There are some instances where your bank can't be connected automatically and you can actually add those manually down here. So we're gonna go the route of connecting a new automatic bank feed by clicking this connect now button. You have to agree to the terms and click proceed. You'll want to search for and select the bank that you use from the options here. I'm going to connect my Relay Bank. It's a great business bank if you are looking for one and I will type in my credentials here. And you'll wanna click the submit button. The system will verify your credentials and get your account connected. It will show you what accounts you have and how much are in each of the accounts. And you'll just wanna verify that's all accurate and then click save and finish. On this next page, you're gonna select the date for which you want to fetch the transaction history. Transactions from the last 90 days can be fetched into Zoho Books. So you'll click into this field and pick which date that you want to start your transactions for this bank account and then click the add button. And that's it. You've connected your first bank account. If you scroll down on the banking page, you'll see now that I have a petty cash account that is automatically added by Zoho as well as undeposited funds. And then you can see this is the account that I actually pulled in from Relay, this taxes account that shows that it has $50. You would repeat this process uh, by using this button up here at the top that says add bank or credit card to connect additional bank accounts to your system until you have all of your bank and credit card accounts connected. This also includes your PayPal accounts. I would recommend connecting those as well as you do your bookkeeping. In one of my following videos, I will show you what to do with these transactions and how to categorize your transactions from the bank feed. Thanks for watching.